So this is what the current application looks like. We're moving through this synthetic EEG. It has this EMG components in it. They're higher frequency. They just come through the signal as you scroll. I don't know why this it's using a lot of my CPU as well. Anyway, the idea is that we have this artifact to risk. Can we make sure the EEG data variable is only 10 seconds of data that is currently visible, uh, that is loaded based on the scroller position. Also, this variable has too many data points after the decimal point. Can we reduce that? So rounding to two decimal points. Yeah, let's double check that in JavaScript. It's one of the changes. Yeah, the constant being outside the if loop makes sense. Right, the numbers are changing. CPU is doing extra, extra hours. Okay, this variables is always the same value. It gives the same value. Why? We need to print amplitude and in both of them. Is it? That wasn't just working before. So frequency is changing. Amplitude is changing. Amplitude is an array. Is it meant to be this way? And frequency is, is one number. Can we display everything on the front panel? We want to be able to see exactly how the input variables are changing and how the defuzzification and fuzzification are changing with the scrolling of the synthetic EEG. Okay, we need more modifications. We would like the whole uh, membership function to be displayed and ideally the input the values the activation to be displayed on top of these uh, charts right so we have another root so we have gen generate eg analyze eg and then we have this one as well front end javascript now in javascript select the whole code to visualize the membership functions fuzzy variable yeah we need to visualize all those yeah using chart js are we using plot data no async function is constant can stay together it's the event listener this membership uh, membership function can go here we need to prompt for interactive eg data scrolling this show will have to change the html okay, so currently this one is not being used right that's why we need this code we're modifying an existing function stringify async analyze and display a plot that is not working analyze and display a Right, we need to also, how about the prompt for changing the HTML code? Chief fuzzy logic analysis, we have the EG chart, new section. So we can replace this section. Okay, we got a lot of stuff. Yeah, I like to combine alpha trace frequency, amplitude, I'm getting an error. It's a JavaScript issue, isn't it? It's just the const plot data activation level membership function. Meant to be multiple membership functions. The plots are not displaying anything. Is there anything wrong with the code? Even when I move the scroller. Based on the JavaScript code you provided, the implementation seems mostly correct, but there are a few areas where issues might arise. Fetching membership function data. The function analyze and display EEG fetches membership function data via get underscore membership underscore functions. Ensure this endpoint is correctly implemented in your Flask backend and is returning the expected format of data. If there's an issue with the backend response, the charts might not display correctly. Data format and parsing. The plot membership functions function expects data in a specific format, an array of X, Y, pairs for each membership function. Make sure the data received from the backend matches this expectation. 
The canvas elements, amplitude chart, frequency chart, artifact risk chart, exist in your HTML with the correct ids. Can you generate prompts for GitHub Copilot? We also using control, no, control I for the whole thing. What? Oh, that was a too generic prompt. I did the law and log each other and membership functions. Uh, this function is not being called, is it? Okay, might just continue next time. So, yeah, bye.